360's Randy Kay has been in Iowa for the last couple of days trying to get answers from Republican officials about the whistleblower complaint, President Trump in Ukraine. Last night, she tried to pin down Iowa Republican Senator Joni Ernst about it. She was met with a string of non-answers. Tonight, she tried to get some questions to Vice President Mike Pence. And before we show you his exchange with Randy, there are two pieces of sound that you need to hear. The first is what then-candidate for Vice President Mike Pence said during the 2016 campaign about whether foreigners should interfere in American elections. Now, y'all need to know out there, this is, this is basic stuff. Foreign donors and certainly foreign governments cannot participate in the American political process. Wow, okay, it's basic stuff, he said. Golly gee, seems simple, right? Here's the second piece of sound, this time from the president less, uh, uh, from the, the president less than a week on, ago on the South Lawn of the White House talking about Ukraine. They should investigate the Bidens because how does a company that's newly formed and all these companies, if you look at, and by the way, likewise, China should start an investigation into the Bidens. I remember Marco Rubio said that was a joke. Clearly it's not. So Randy, you had a chance to ask the vice president about all this. How'd that go? Well, Anderson, uh, it was interesting to say the least. We started by asking him about those 2016 comments that you just played about a foreign government uh, taking part or, or weighing in on the American political process. And um, he sort of uh, took a turn from there. Here's a look. Mr. Vice President, during the campaign 2016, you had said that uh, foreign governments cannot participate in the American political process. Do you still stand by that today? Well, I do. I think that's why President Trump uh, was so concerned about a foreign interference in our election in Ukraine. If you read the transcript, you will see that the president said to President Zelensky that our country had been through a lot, and then he had a question about foreign interference in our 2016 election. I mean, to be honest with you, when, when did you all lose interest in foreign interference in the 2016 election? President but Trump that wants to get to the truth. He wants to know what happened in 2016. And the American people have a right to know. Right, but the month. president himself has said that he asked Ukrainian a foreign government to company. investigate his domestic political rival. So is that okay with you? I, I, don't, I, I don't believe that's the case. And again, but I, I, I know that's said, the way that... He said it. The president said I know that's said the way that, Chairman so. Schiff characterized it in the his manufactured version lawn. of the transcript. But the American people should read the transcript, and they will see that the president did nothing wrong. There was no pressure. There was no quid pro quo. The president simply raised issues uh, of, of importance and interest to the American people. Wow. Well, Anderson, the uh, vice president's handlers uh, quickly ended the gaggle right after those comments. But you heard him there saying that President Trump, uh, he doesn't believe President Trump asked a foreign power, asked Ukraine to investigate uh, Joe Biden, his political rival. We all know that is not true. How do we know that? Because the president has said that. We know it. We've seen it in the transcript, as you know, that the White House released to the public. And we also know it because the president, as you just heard, doubled down. Uh, on the White House lawn. We heard that in your introduction. So uh, for some reason, Vice President Pence just will not accept that no matter how many times I tried to tell him that there uh, yeah, I mean, today. I, I, Very I, strange experience. I mean, he could read. I, I, I can't imagine he doesn't know the facts. He's just, I mean, I, I mean, he, you know, likes to seem as if he believes everything yep. he says, but it just seems hard to imagine. I mean, the president called on China to investigate uh, uh, one of the most repressive regimes are, are around. Right. The idea that, uh, yeah. It's amazing. And no, right. uh, it doesn't surprise me and that they ended the gaggle. not was I saying it, but there were other reporters. Yeah. Yeah, but there were other reporters even weighing in, backing me up, saying he said it on the White House lawn. Right. He doubled down on the White House lawn and still would not accept it. All right, Randy, it's a thankless task. Thanks very much. Appreciate it.